In this video I have noughts and crosses. Uh, to begin with I'll give a brief demonstration of the game and then I'll just explain a little bit of how it works. So to start off with you can just play a normal two player by just starting to push buttons. And there you go, it has a win detection just there. Uh, you can also swap who starts. So if I just push that button down there, I start as X. And the win detection works the same way. For that, you can also play against a CPU opponent. So if I push that and start playing, there you go. You can also select whether or not that's an X that's um, the CPU, and you can also, with this button here, select whether or not the CPU opponent starts. And you can also block your moves. So if I move down there, well, that was a bad example there. Um, well, anyway, I'll explain that. Um, so essentially what it's doing is if you haven't made any moves that it needs to block, it just works off of it. This shift register here, which just runs through a select set of moves, which starts basically at five and then works to one and then goes to nine. So it's basically working to make rows. And if you block it, it will and it doesn't need to block you, it will default to its next move. Um, otherwise it will block you. And if it has the choice of making two moves, it'll just make the lowest like number in the selection along here. So this will be like one, two, three, four, five, six. So if it had to make a choice between say three and nine, it would just, or three and seven, sorry, it would pick three. Um, and it also knows whether or not if, um, whether or not it can win over blocking you. So if um, it can make a winning move, it will choose that over blocking you. So if I were to go, say, here, It'll go there, and if I go here, it'll go there, and if I select that, it knows that it can win, as opposed to blocking my move. Um, pretty much what's going on is, yeah, so that's the shift register that just basically goes into uh, this purple thing here, which takes care of the moves you've made and the whether or not you can, whether or not you have two in a row. So this information is also given to the opponent. So if this is playing as the CPU or this is playing as the CPU, they both know each other's moves and know whether or not to block them and also know whether or not they can win. Um, and these here are basically just whether or not these display a naught or a cross. And that's basically it. So yeah, thank you for watching.